I love America, but we got to stop ostracizing people. Like, it's almost illegal to be fat in America. I don't like that. I'll tell you one thing, though. Certain situations, I don't like heavier people with me. For example, if you're overweight, don't get on certain things. For example, the three train. <laughs> if you haven't seen the three train, three train is already pre-decoded of how, people sh how big a person should be. And it's color coded. It's about this wide red, this wide yellow, this wide red. This lady sat next to me. And if you're over a certain size, don't sit next to the person that's sitting next to the pole. Because that hurts. <laughs> she sat down and squeezed. It was to the point that her cellulite was on my lap. And I'm, you gotta understand, she's right here. The poles are right here, and I am right here. I'm like, oh my God, this hurts. She gonna talk about, well, is there a problem? You damn right it's a problem. I can't feel my legs because you want to sit down on the train. But if you're fat, be fat. <laughs> Don't get on things like Slim Fat. Don't get on things like Slim Fast. Y'all remember Slim Fast? That little powder that you add a little water to and maybe a pinch of baking soda two weeks later and make you lose weight? You want to know another powder that you add a little water and a little baking soda to? And it can make you lose weight way faster than Slim Fast? Crack cocaine. The crack diet will have you skinny in three hours. It'll cost $15 in all 32 of your teeth. <laughs> you come back from the crack diet looking just like this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Anybody have kids? My round of applause, kids? Kids? Okay, forget it then. <laughs> I got my STD test before I left high school. Thank God everything came back clean. But one thing that frightened me was the nurse came up. She was like, I don't mean to scare you, but one out of four kids that come here have some type of STD. Let me tell you why that was so scary. It was only four kids in the office that day. <laughs> this girl next to me said, achoo. I said, woman, if you get chlamydia on me, I will murder you. <laughs> Because if you watch the STD commercials, you would think herpes is the thing to have. You ever seen this commercial? This white woman's run through fields of flowers, smiling. I have genital herpes. <laughs> then you see her partner walk back, and I don't. <laughs> then they meet in the middle and kiss, and we're trying to keep it that way. If my girl ever came up to me like, Nico, I got herpes. Chick, you got what? <laughs> you told me those was razor bumps. <laughs> 10 seconds later, you'll see me finishing that commercial just, hi, my wife is missing. <laughs> and I'm trying to keep it that way. <laughs> Nico White.